Septon is a fabricated word uh, borrowing from the word perception. C-E-P-T is uh, part of perception. And O-N is this uh, uh, ending of a Latin for an element. So septon really indicates it's an element of perception uh, that indicates it's LIDAR, is actually the software running LIDAR, the overall intelligence of a LIDAR, element of perception. Now, Junpei, who's the CEO and one of the co-founders, has assembled a terrific team. Uh, he was introduced to me many years ago by a mutual friend of ours. And this mutual friend I consider a, a genius, uh, actually, in math. And so this friend uh, described Jun as a genius in building sensors. And so I said, I should probably meet Junpei. Junpei is really a LiDAR pioneer. I mean, he led the engineering team that built the first automotive LiDAR that went on top of the, uh, the uh, DARPA Grand Challenge vehicles and started this whole revolution on autonomy. But after a time, he was watching the, the rise of autonomous vehicle technology, uh, and as well as the development of LiDAR, and, and felt that the spinning LiDARs that and other companies had developed were not suitable for autonomous vehicle mass market. Nobody wants a car with a big spinning bubble on its roof. So Junpei has been building and thinking about LiDAR for over 15 years. That's a huge advantage over others. When I had the thought of starting Septon Technologies, uh, I reached out to Mark first, uh, uh, giving you know, his mentorship and his expertise in optics and just the overall uh, desire to work together again. So, and so June came to me and, and uh, we talked about how we could uh, start a company uh, in the LiDAR business that would develop LiDARs for the mass market of automobiles. Develop LiDARs that would be small enough and compact enough to be integrated into the vehicle in a seamless fashion. And that was the start of, of Septon. And in fact, we didn't even really know at that point how we were going to do this. We just knew that this needed to be done and there should be a way to do it. And so we set out to figure out how to do this. And this was one of the first um, uh, inventions that we made it in the company was the, uh, the MMT scanning principle that we've talked about. There's a significant barrier to entry created by its MMT platform. I mean, it's frictionless, it's mirrorless, and there's a significant amount of intelligence in the form of algorithms and software. MMT is a unique technology invented by Septon. This came from the requirement of ADAS industry that you need to strike a balance between performance, cost, and reliability. Without striking the proper balance, uh, it will never become a practical automotive component. The requirement came down to design, to invention, and ultimately we packaged the MMT, this micro motion technology for LiDAR, to arrive at the correct balance uh, for this application. Well, there are many sensors uh, that would exist uh, in high-end vehicles to start with. Like early days, uh, even cameras would exist only in luxury vehicles. Going to middle-class vehicles and perhaps even broader uh, class bases uh, would actually enable the broader proliferation of this technology. And ultimately, LiDAR, its first application is as a safety sensor. As a result, it will bring safety to the everyday consumers and is there to save lives. When Junpei decided to start Septon five years ago, it was not a surprise to me that he wanted to build LiDAR to go in every single vehicle, uh, to make every single driver on the road safer. People's desire for safety will never end. When you have a 90% safety level, you want a 99%. And once you accomplish 99%, you want 99.9%. .9%. The desire for additional level of safety will never end. This is where anything that can help people to accomplish a higher level of safety is very much desired. LiDAR is there to do just that.